A question about purity. It's, you know, a big subject, but let me tell you a few words. Purity is the fruit of spiritual life. When you come closer to God, the Holy Spirit will purify your heart, your mind, your will, and your body. Because we are the altars of the Holy Spirit. So the idea of purification, it's not only the struggle of man, it's the grace of God. So when you work hard to purify your life, you need the power of God in purification. Because you cannot get rid of any bad thing, any lust in your life with your will. You cannot conquer evil things with your mind. You need the power of God. But in order to have this pure heart, you need to study the word of God. Because the word of God is very strong and it works like the living water. So this living water will, will wash you, wash your mind and wash your heart, so you will get this purification. And also the sacrament of repentance and confession, when you repent regularly, when you go for confession, this helps you to get the purification of God. But when you stick to your bad habits and think negatively, and look around to follow people living around you, you are far away from pure life. And also for the purity, it's not only to stay away from the bad major sins like adultery or having bad relationships. It's about the pure purity of senses. Your eyes are pure, your ears are pure, your mouth, your tongue is pure, your mind is really pure. So your heart is full of love and very pure. So purity, it's not to stop doing bad things, but to do very good things, to be righteous like God. So purity is the gift of God to those who struggle for being purified before the eyes of God.